Caution lights are out. Dylan Knowles, Trey Mills, feature number one of the second annual Alabama Gang 100. Sees the course of the performance. Green flag are underway. In a turn number one, Dylan Knowles going to lead them early. Here comes Brandon Overton to the inside of Trey Mills. Battle for the second position. Caution is out. We got the number 25 of Roselle spun here on the front straightaway. Take two here in qualifying feature number one of the second annual Alabama Gang 100. Back underway. Dylan Knowles going to lead them. Down the back straight away, Brandon Overton with a way better restart this time. He'll take the inside and take second from Trey Mills. Trey Mills going to follow. David Brazil in the 54, way high and handsome off turn number four, trying to make some ground. He'll go to the outside of Drake Troutman. They go side by side, fourth position. And now Brazil gets two for the first of one off the turn number four. David Brazil, the only one on the top side here, and it's paying dividends. Brandon Overton in second. Shepard going to go to the top side. Trouble! David Brazil around in turn number one. And we have chaos. Brent Larson, Shirley, Roselle, Millwood, and Hammett. Some slow to avoid, some made contact. And Nick Hoffman, the 11 of Cruz Skinner, all able to drive away. And Trey Mills did not get the start he wanted. Brandon Overton will drive away with it. How about Tanner English right around the outside? We might go three wide down the back turn away. Here comes Dale McDowell. Michael Page right around the middle. Tanner English on the top side. Off the corner, number four. 17M. Oh, Dale McDowell runs his bend. Here comes the 157 of Mike Mahler. Can he get into the top three? That's where you want to be to get into the top six redraw for the big dance tomorrow. Dale McDowell gets around Michael Page. What a boot that was in turns three and four. Now Mike Mahler going to go after Michael Page. And it turns one and two. Mahler right around the outside. Oh, 157 is absolutely flying around this racetrack. So Mike Marler yes, yes. in the hot pit as well. Tough break, a right rear for him. And of course, the you know the retaining wall here. Is this going to be a trend? Turn number one, Trey Mills around the outside. Trying to get around the 76 of Brandon Overton. Here comes Trey Mills. they will go side by side with Overton. Michael Page, Dale McDowell side by side behind him. Top five cover of under a blanket. On turn number four. Here comes Dale McDowell. Outside looking in, looking for a top six redraw spot. Michael Page way high and one and two, and Page gonna kiss the wall and he's up at the wall. Caution is out for Michael Page. Dylan Knowles continuing to lead us at 66 K, the Alabama driver. Solid job up front this time. Trey Mills right around the bottom. Brandon Overton will race on by on the outside down the back straightaway. Here comes Drake Troutman and Dale McDowell side by side for the fourth position. Madden on the inside. Here comes the 44. Chris Madden. He gets around Dale McDowell. The 44 is on the move. Off the corner number four. Brandon Overton closing the gap. This top wave off the white flag. One lap to go. This is the Barretts. One lap to go. In the turn number one, Dylan Knowles has the lead. Can Overton steal it on the final lap? Dylan Knowles has pretty good. Lead going into turn number three, off a corner number four. How about it? He's going to the top six redraw. Winner, Dylan Knowles. Brandon Overton second, and Trey Mills will join them in the redraw. I'm pretty confident in the car. I mean, I really got to shout out Don Cook for this. He called me about an hour before we practice and told me to change the whole car, and it panned out, and I'm tickled to death with it. I Never thought I'd be here in victory line with y'all guys. Qualifying feature number two underway here at the Talladega Short Track. Jimmy Owens will take the early race lead. Max McLaughlin right around the outside on turn number two. Look to the outside, now looks to the inside. RTJ and Tyler Brunick, wheel to wheel four. Third position, Owens, McLaughlin, RTJ, the top three. Caution is out, turn number four. Tristan Chamberlain in the 20 TC. Back to the Gorsuch performance green flag. Jimmy Owens and Max McLaughlin will lead us back to green. Oh, Matt Max didn't get the restart he wanted. Jimmy Owens will lead off of turn number two. Here comes RTJ right around the bottom. The 20 RT digging for gold on the bottom. He'll pull alongside Jimmy Owens and they both touch. They go around your whole field. Oh, man, caution is out. Absolute chaos to kick off qualifying feature number two, RTJ to the inside of Jimmy Owens, and RTJ did everything he could to avoid the 20, but just had so much speed going into the corner. When he pitched the car sideways, the momentum still carried him and made contact with the 20 of Owens. Obviously nothing intentional, just hard racing there from RTJ, had a lot of speed, and Jimmy Owens, Max McLaughlin, complete restart again here in feature number two. Max McLaughlin with a way better restart this time, but is it enough to 
We get around to 20 of Owens. Jimmy Owens will have second off of turn number four. Max McLaughlin and Kyle Larson breaks the turn number four. Then the break, but overshot the cushion there in turn number four. Fell off the pace tremendously, and Kyle Larson lost wholesale positions in the number six. Meanwhile, we complete a lap here at feature number two. Max McLaughlin will lead the way in the 22 star. Ricky Thornton Jr. takes second. Jimmy Owens going to go back to his inside, and oh, Gustin. Getting racing there in the top side, Pierce. Going to get around him. Here comes Kyle Larson to the inside of Gustin. New top three. Laughlin, then RTJ, then Jimmy Owens in third. Ricky Thornton Jr. second. Jimmy Owens third. Here comes Sam Seawright. Sam Seawright knows. Sands in the hourglass could run out any moment here with Mother Nature playing with us. And down the front straight away. Here comes the 16 of Sam Seawright. Seawright has it. We're past halfway. Raindrops starting to fall a little heavier here at the Talladega Short Track. And it is confirmed, checkered flag, checkered flag. The rule is if we pass halfway, you could end it. Max McLaughlin is your winner. Ricky Thornton Jr. will finish second and Sam Seawright in third. I don't really even know what to say right now. Um, this is only my fifth time in a, a super late model and um, they have been such a challenge. And if you would have told me that I was gonna win tonight, I would have probably told you you were crazy. But um, Al Hankey, Mohawk Northeast, first of all, um, he's been uh, the reason I'm a race car driver for the last 10 years. He uh, gave me the opportunity to be here, so pretty uh, emotional. I feel good. I mean, um, you know, I'm a young guy in this sport. I don't really know what I'm doing in these things yet, but when you have a good race car, it, it makes my job a lot easier. And GR Smith gave me the call after World Finals and asked me if I wanted to come drive late models. And it's been my dream since I was a kid to drive a late model. So GR Smith, Mohawk Northeast, Tim, that kid works his ass off in the shop every day. So uh, Tim Creer's going to have a hell of a, a future in this sport. And, Armor Security, Gambler Transport, Victory Circle, um, the Brick House Tavern, just everybody that uh, makes this possible. Longhorn, Bill Steen, this is pretty damn cool. For live coverage of every World of Outlaws event and for extended on-demand race content, visit DirtVision.com. For full race results, features, and series news, visit WorldOfOutlaws.com.